Hi, this is Sherry Veronica. There was a prisoner at the Central Police Station that when they, the police made their regular checks, they found him unresponsive. They called for an ambulance, but none were available. So they had to call a medical doctor. And when the doctor arrived, he pronounced Kimo Grant, 29 years old of Grazette's Main Road, St. Michael, dead. He was dead in the cell at Central Police Station. It's reminiscent of some other people who have died in um, the police station there in Barbados. When I did a check on this chemo grant, he, he was a recidivist. Chemo is known to the police. Chemo grant is known to your hotel there in St. Philip. Okay, um, he, he, he he made his rounds, let me put it that way. He made his rounds and he was on the um, illegal side of, you know, of things, he, he, you know. So I'm sure that um, he will have people to mourn him, no doubt. But um, Kimo, at 29 years old, um, was a recidivist, okay? He was a recidivist. And you can see here, September 2020, and probably before that, you know, things that he he was not caught for. But um, yeah, here, here, 2013, if he's 29 now, and this is 11 years ago, Jesus, you could, you, a teenager, he was at it from young, from very young, he was um, known to the police. So we have to wait to see. Uh, what is going to come out of this, you know, the moms, usually, not the dads, but the moms usually jump up and down and, you know, and say whatever they have to say. And, you know, he's an angel and whatever else they will say, but um, he was known to the system from before he was a teenager, probably. Yeah, but, I, but certainly when he was a teenager, he was before the courts. Okay, so this came in. He um, is deceased. He has transitioned. And that's it for Kimo Grant, 29 years old, of Grazette's Main Road, St. Michael. This is Sherry Veronica.